Today I'm going to show you how to make a root beer float. Start by opening up your carton of vanilla ice cream. Any brand will do, but I suggest using your favorite brand. I'm using Friendly's Vanilla Ice Cream from Wilbraham, Massachusetts. That's where their headquarters is. And just start by scooping out a few nice big scoops and putting them into a chilled mug. I suggest uh, putting that mug into the freezer just for a few minutes, maybe 10, 15 minutes, get it nice and cold, and just fill that mug up with ice cream. Push it down a little bit. And uh, now I'm going to put away this ice cream carton, and we'll move on to the next step. Great, so now we're going to take our, our root beer soda. This is actually a bottle of Jones Root Beer, which is a popular alternative brand. Some other popular brands are A&W Root Beer, Mugs Root Beer, Barks Root Beer, but if you can get a local brand, that's, uh, that's even better. And just pour it into your mug, slowly at first. There's going to be a lot of foam, a lot of bubbles coming up to the top of the glass. You're going to want to watch out for that so it doesn't spill over. You'll see I have uh, quite a head on this glass, just mushrooming over the top. What you can do is take a straw and just kind of suck up some of those those bubbles. It's going to be kind of uh, um, light and airy when you uh, when you take those in. Now, of course, if you're making this for someone else, I I don't recommend doing that. But if it's just for you, go right ahead. And uh, I'm going to pour a little bit more in here. We're using almost about half of this bottle of soda, and uh, that's that's pretty good. I'm pretty happy with this. I'm going to stick my straw all the way in, and uh, I think it's time to enjoy a delicious root beer float. As you can see, I have my spoon handy, too. Uh, great for scooping out the ice cream, which is now surrounded by the root beer flavor. It's, it's quite a treat. And that's it. That's all there is to making a root beer float. It's pretty simple, pretty quick, and pretty easy. Hope you enjoyed watching this video. Thanks.